education is mostly rote, and they're not taught how to solve problems. They're not given the tools, emotionally or within their own field, of how to do critical thinking. A resource-based economy, the education would be very different. Our society's major concern is mental development and to motivate each person to their highest potential. Because our philosophy is the smarter people are, the richer the world. Because everybody becomes a contributor. The smarter your kids are, the better my life will be. Because they'll be contributing more constructively to the, to the environment and to my life. Because everything that we devise within a resource-based economy would be applied to society. There would be nothing to hold it back. Patriotism, weapons, armies, navies, all that is a sign that we're not civilized yet. Kids will ask their parents, didn't you see the necessity of the machines? Dad, couldn't you see that war was inevitable when you produce scarcity? Isn't it obvious? Of course the kid will understand that you were pinheads raised merely to serve the established institutions. We're such an abominable, sick society that we won't make the history book. They just say that large nations took land from smaller nations, used force and violence. You get history talked about as corrupt behavior all the way along until the beginning of the civilized world. That's when all the nations work together. World unification, working toward common good for all human beings and without anyone being subservient to anyone else, without social stratification, whether it be technical elitism or any other kind of elitism, eradicated from the face of the earth. The state does nothing because there is no state. There is no state. The system I advocate, a resource-based global economy, is not perfect. It's just a lot better than what we have. We can